During his meeting with the president today in Washington, Governor DeSantis said he will reveal his plans to start reopening the state tomorrow. Tarek was listening to the joint White House news conference and is joining us now with the details. Tarek? Well, DeSantis told the president that Florida's ability to test people for the virus now exceeds current demand. The governor says moving to the first phase of reopening the economy should not require much heavy lifting. Florida health authorities have attributed many of the state's COVID-19 cases to people traveling from other hotspots, including Europe, the Nile River cruises, the New York City area, and Latin America. DeSantis also responded to criticism for not closing the state sooner. And what have the results been? You look at some of the most draconian orders that have been issued in some of these states and compare Florida in terms of our hospitalizations per 100,000, in terms of our fatalities per 100,000. I mean, you go from D.C., Maryland, New Jersey, New York, Connecticut, Massachusetts, Michigan, Indiana, Ohio, Illinois, you name it. Florida's done better, and I'm not criticizing those states, but everyone in the media was saying Florida was going to be like New York or Italy. And that has not happened because we understood we have a big diverse state. We understood the outbreak was not uniform throughout the state, and we had a tailored and measured approach. This is a good example of a partnership between the federal government and a state government. Ron has been great. And some of your friends, some of the other governors have done a good job, and some haven't done a very good job, I'll be honest with you. Some have not. DeSantis also said he's concerned about coronavirus cases increasing in some of the Latin American countries like Brazil when their seasons change. Now, the governor is calling on airlines to do more to test passengers from those boarding uh, from those countries prior to boarding. The president saying he's talking to the airline industry about giving passengers temperature checks and testing them for COVID-19 before their flights.